Hey there, and welcome to episode number 200 of Our Young Creators, the podcast. My name is Young Pratt, your host and the chief dreamer right here at Our Young Creators. And this, my friends, is the final episode of 2018 for the podcast. I want to take a quick moment just to say thank you to everyone out there who has watched our videos, who has downloaded our podcast, people who send me emails and messages and continually ask us questions and cheer us on for everything we've been doing over this past year. A couple of days ago in episode 198, I talked about all the different things we have discovered about our business and about ourselves here at Our Young Creators in 2018. And yesterday, we counted down the top 10 most downloaded episodes of the year as well. I invite you to go back and listen to those episodes in particular to get a good feel about what the year has brought and what this year has really meant to us because it all started with an experiment. If you're tuning in live or catching the replay, go ahead and comment and let me know that you are here for that. And if you are listening on, to the, pod on the podcast, thank you for doing that. And if you have comments, I invite you to come over to our website, ouryoungcreators.com slash 200 to continue the conversation. Our Young Creators, if you don't already know, began as an experiment. The experiment began in the fall of 2017 when I was curious to know if my girls could learn the skills necessary to replace my virtual assistant. These skills included things like learning to edit the podcast, creating images to share on our website and across social media, how to put together our blog posts, and so much more. And I am delighted to share that the experiment has been an incredible success. And now both of my daughters are actively working not only in our business to help deliver more content to you and serve you all better. They are both working for other entrepreneurs as well. So the lesson here is that kids are more capable than we give them credit for often. And their desire to be on their devices is something that we can turn into a positive by teaching them how to learn new skills, apply those skills, and learn to serve other people in the process. So with this being our final episode of the year, I wanted to sort of forecast ahead for you and let you know what is going to be happening, particularly here on the podcast, as well as in our young creators in general. So once again, this is the final episode of 2018, and we're actually going to take four weeks off from releasing a new podcast. And we're doing that for a number of reasons. The main reason is that for the past couple of months, we've been pushing out more and more episodes to where over the past month or so, we have been releasing five episodes a week. And that is no small task, let me assure you. So we need to take a little bit of time to reflect on what we've learned over this past year and over these past 100 episodes since February 14th when we relaunched the podcast. And that's going to carry us forward into the new year. Now, here are a couple of the things that we want to do with your help. So in the new year, we are going to release our first episode probably right around the 20th or so of January. That will be after I return from a mastermind retreat in Dallas. So I'll be ready to go with lots of new ideas and energy, of course. But the other reason we are doing that is because over these next four weeks, we need your help. 
We've gotten so much feedback throughout the year and so many questions about a number of topics, mainly in the realms of podcasting and bringing your kids into your business. Those are the main kinds of questions we get. And so I invite you to head over to our website, ouryoungcreators.com, and you'll notice a little button that hovers on the side of your screen, whether you're on mobile or on desktop, and all it says is leave a message. If you have questions about podcasting, and it can be any kind of questions, how do you start, how do you scale, how do you monetize, any of those questions are valid. Please head over there and leave me a question about that. And then if you have kids that you would be interested in having them join you in your business or helping them learn skills so they can help someone else in their business as a virtual assistant or a social media manager or a podcast manager, head over to the website as well and leave those questions for me because in the new year, it's all about you. I really want to make sure we are serving you to the best of our abilities. And in order to do that, we need to know what you want to learn about. And of course, if there are other topics that are not included in those two, please go to the website and ask those questions as well. Because again, we are here to serve you and to serve your kids and to really help you to harness the power that technology offers us in this day and age. What we're also going to do in 2019 is do smaller series of podcasts, meaning in 2018, we released 100 episodes and they were on different topics. They And they were typically grouped together in different kind of groupings. However, in the new year, you're going to see us create smaller groupings that are really specific to a particular topic. So our plan right now is to release two episodes a week, and we're gonna do that for five consecutive weeks. So 10 total episodes all about one particular topic. Ideally, we're going to do one podcast episode each week. That is me coming here to share about whatever the topic of that season is, and then bringing on a guest to really dive into more of the details of that particular topic. Then after those five weeks are over, after those 10 episodes are done, we're going to ask you again to give us some feedback, ask us questions, because we wanna feature your questions and your success stories and whatever else you would like to share with us on the podcast. We don't want this to be about just us and what my kids and I are creating in our business and in others. We want to be able to feature you and your kids and your business and your success stories that you've had with us throughout the year. And so in those four weeks, we are gonna continually be asking questions, asking you to head to our website and leave us messages and ask us questions because we want to make sure that we are delivering information that you want to hear about frequently. And in terms of what we have going on for classes in the new year, I will just tell you that we have some new classes that we are planning, the first of which is going to kick off in January. So be looking for an announcement right here on our Facebook page. And if you're not already on our email list, you can do that by requesting one of our free guides. And our newest guide right now is 50 winter boredom busters. If you have kids at home or know someone who does and they're now embarking or enjoying their Christmas break, these are 50 kid approved ideas that the girls and I sat down to create together just last week that can inspire kids and parents to do something different over the holidays and really give kids a number of activities they can dive into on their own 
or with the parent or guardian's assistance. You can grab that at our website at ouryoungcreators.com slash winter. And when you do that, you are going to be on our email list, which means you're going to find out about this brand new class that is coming up in January of the new year. And our most popular program, Podcast in a Weekend, will also be coming back in the new year, probably in the middle of quarter one. And if you're interested in getting on that list and knowing before anybody else when the doors for enrollment are open, definitely reach out, message me right here on Facebook, or send me an email and let me know that you're interested so we can get you on our VIP waiting list because we have a number of people who throughout this fall season have said, hey, I really want to get into podcasting a weekend. I really want to start this podcast for my business or with my kids. And they haven't been able to attend the classes we've had so far. So if you want to get on that list and know when the next class is, just reach out and I will be sure to add you to our email list so you can know as soon as we tell anybody. And of course, we have some other fun classes and other events coming up in 2019. I won't reveal any of the details now. Just know we're super excited about what we have planned for the new year for you and your kids and to help you build things together for your business. Okay, my friends, if you have questions on the replay of this episode, please leave them down below in the comments. If you're listening on the podcast, head over to ouryoungcreators.com slash 200 and ask your questions there, leave your comments, and definitely head over to our website and use our new leave a voice message feature where you can ask questions about podcasting. You can ask questions about including your kids in your business and beyond, or any other questions you have related to automation and really being smart with how you are marketing and sharing the things that you're creating. Definitely, we want to hear from you. Again, the website is ouryoungcreators.com and just click on the leave a voice message button right on the side of the screen and leave us a message. We'd love to hear from you because in the new year, we want to really make sure that we stay focused and on task and really help all of you parents and all of you entrepreneurs out there with kids really start to bond over the time you're both spending on your devices. So we can turn our consumption time on those devices into creation time. I wish you a very Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. And I will be back going live tomorrow because this is day number 13 of 100 days of Facebook Live. So. I'll be here, but this is the final episode of the year, and the new episode will release towards the end of January. You'll find out the exact dates by following us here on Facebook at Our Young Creators, over on Instagram at Our Young Creators, and you can definitely come over to our website. Hang out with us there, engage with us, definitely ask your questions so we can make 2019 all about serving you. I will catch you next time. Cheers, my friends.